So ladies, welcome to my channel. Thank you for stopping by. If you're new here, my name is JB The Mentor. And I wanna take a little time to talk about six things that turn men on. So stay tuned. So ladies, you get a lot of advice from your girlfriends. And sometimes your girlfriends, they think they know everything about men, but they really don't. And they're trying to figure it out too, but they're trying to play cool, and they're trying to pretend like they know it all. And most of them, they don't know it all because they themselves are looking for men. So one thing that turns a man on is when you're able to tell him that he's sexy. You whisper in his ear and you tell him, listen, right now, there's no one more sexy than you. When you let him know that everything about him turns you on and gets you percolating and makes you hot, because that's all he lives for, is for those words to leave your lips, to tell him how special he is and how he is an aphrodisiac for you. The second thing that you can do to turn a man on is to tell a man that you love his mind, you love the way he thinks, you love the way that he can logically come to conclusions, that his mind is a real turn on for you. Because at the end of the day, a man's mind is his most powerful asset. And if you tell him that his mind is what turns you on, he will work endlessly to communicate with you. He will work endlessly to have conversations with you. He will work endlessly to make sure that there's some kind of back and forth between you and him intellectually because you adore his mind. So the third thing that turns a man on is simply this. When you ladies take the initiative to initiate sex, when you say, listen, you know what? Tonight I'm gonna put it on you. Tonight I wanna make love to you. When he comes through that door from work, you're waiting, you're ripping his clothes off, and you're pulling him to the bedroom. When you initiate this, it says to him, yes, I'm the man. And every now and then, he needs to feel like he's the man. And when you give him that energy, and you make that declaration that you're ready to do this, and he doesn't have to ask you or worry about being rejected because in the moment you're not there, that is an awesome place to be as a man. The fourth thing that turns men on is simply this. When you let him know that you're willing to explore any sexual adventure because you love him and he means that much to you and you've totally surrendered. Let me say this again. When you tell your man that you're willing to explore any sexual adventure and you're ready to surrender, but you're doing this for him because you love him that much and he means so much to you. And so the fourth thing that you can do to turn your man on is to tell him that you're willing to explore any sexual adventure that he might have. And this to him means that you're willing to surrender your body, mind, and soul to him. And then that is a once in a lifetime place to be with a woman, to know that he has had that kind of effect on you and that he's getting that privilege, that is an honor, and that's taking your man to cloud nine. It's six o'clock. <laughs> that is taking your man to cloud nine and letting him know that in that moment that he is the king and you are his queen. The fifth thing that you can do to turn your man on is to tell him that you love the way he makes you feel, the way he makes you smile, the way he makes you walk, the way he makes you feel protected, the way he provides for you, the way he talks to you and whisper in your ear, the way he holds your hand when you're walking down the street, that everything about him makes you feel special. When you tell a man that, you are locking him up and you're securing him. And he's saying to himself, there's no other place that I would rather be than right here with this woman because you are saying that right now, the most important thing in your life is this man. 
and he loves that and he craves it. So the last thing that you can do to turn your man on, it's been around for ages and I don't see it going any place. And that's preparing a great meal for him. You know, ladies, they used to say back in the days that the way to a man's heart is through his stomach. And it is true. When you take the time to prepare a special meal for him, that is one of the greatest acts of love. It is a moment of intimacy. It is a moment of deep commitment. It's a moment of love. But most importantly, it's a time when you display hard work, dedication, and a willingness to find a way to please him in that kitchen. And he himself surrenders to you because at this point, no one can feed his soul like you can. So if you're willing to prepare a great meal, there isn't anything sexier that I can think of than a woman taking the time to work in that kitchen and to render something that is just absolutely made. And so there you have it. If you love content like this, please leave comments below. Remember to hit that like button, that subscribe button, that bell right there in the middle so that when new content is released, you'll be the first ones to receive it. And remember, your man, every now and then, he just needs a few things to push him in the right direction to let him know how special he is. And I believe that these six tips will do exactly that for you. Remember, there are so many different ways that you can love your man. So why not start?